worldwide. Happy New Year! Happy New Year! Oh, oh, oh! Chase? Jack? Hi, Hi guys! Yeah. What are you doing? What are you doing here? We uh, want to be here for the New Year. Yeah. Oh, well, well, I'm glad you guys are here. Six kids. This is Chase. And this is Jack. They are one of my favorite bands in the world. They are a band of brothers. And I'm so happy that you guys are here with me today. Happy New Year. Happy, happy New, New Year. Year. Well, guess what? This year, we're going to have all kinds of new things going on. But why don't we go back and remember some of the things that happened in 2020 Saints Kids. Y'all want to see some of that stuff? Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's do it. Give me high five. Give me high five. Let's go remember some of the fun stuff that we went through. What does love mean to you? It means that um, people like I care about people. Okay. And why is it important to love other people? Because God loved us. It is important to love each other because we all can be friends. Because that is what our God says though and he, he loves us like he loves us so he wants us to love others like he loves us. Why does God want us to love people? Because He loves Him. Because what? Because He loves Him so much. Because appreciated is a talking about each other. Mm -hmm. It's what we do for each other to, to have our choice. Why is it important to love others? So they can have a good life and they don't get hurt all the time? Because we need to have each other's back because there's a lot going on in the world right now and just gotta pray. Why is it important to show love for others? To show respect for others. Okay, Ali? Because Jesus loved you. Why is it important to love others? Because God made you love others. Because God both loved it, us. It's important to love others because you don't know what the other person is going through. And the feeling of love is the best feeling in the world. Because they care about us. The person who really cares about is Jesus. Love is about caring, hugging, being nice to each other. And that's really nice about love. God says to love your neighbor as yourself. I'm gonna need y'all to shake it out, 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 shake it out. I'm gonna need y'all to lift y'all hands to the sky and give me a oh yeah! <laughs> How about we all try singing it together? For with, with God, God nothing, nothing will, will be impossible. impossible. Luke, Luke chapter, chapter 1, one verse, verse 37. 37. It's shout out time! Shout out to Jackson and Josiah and Ryan and last week's sibling worship team Sonia, Emily, and Miles. And last but not least, Shout out to Amelia and her baby sister, Sienna. We love you, Saints kids! See you next week! We're trying to film and there's music, there's ambulances, there's airplanes, there's trains, there's everything. So it's a little bit hard to record and it's getting dark. We're it's dancing dark. because yeah. there's some music playing and it's very nice music. Oh, okay, we think it's over, so we might be able to record. Faithfulness is being loyal and staying close to God over everything. When we tether ourselves to God and His Word and stay loyal to what He says, we can win the race. That's faithfulness. Ah, oh, okay. 
I think I'm getting it. I really like the part you said about staying close to God over everything. <laughs> Me too. Because, you know, close to God is the best place to be. And that's actually the PowerPoint today. Be loyal and stay close to God over everything. Okay, I gotta try that. Okay. Be loyal and stay close to God and stay close to God over everything. Unless something better comes along? No, no, because that wouldn't be faithfulness. Be loyal and stay close to God over everything. Buddy the Elf? Oh yeah, he's like, oh, I love Buddy the Elf. Yeah. Let's go back and watch it. Okay. <laughs> hold it, hold it, hold it. Did somebody say Christmas? Did you say Christmas? I heard you say Christmas. I love Christmas. I love Christmas too. I love Christmas I'm more. Not. Are you sure? Because I, I love really it. love Christmas. Nope. No? Nope. I love Christmas more. And I get to celebrate with Buddy the Elf. Uh, yeah, I see. Buddy. Uh, okay, um, 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 okay, Andrew, uh, by the way, kids, this is Andrew, but can we let him know that we're in the middle of... Kids. We're in the middle of filming things. Kids, they can see you everywhere. I know. My bad. My bad. Hey, Saints kids, remember when the staff told us what they were scared of? That was pretty funny. Yeah. What about we go back and watch it? Sure. When I think about what I'm afraid of, everything I think about from dogs to snakes to bugs to heights, I realize either I've encountered it and realize it's not that scary, or if I would encounter it, I wouldn't be that afraid because there's always something to understand about this thing. So you can learn, you can approach it the right way and it'll be good. Um, so I think that's pretty much everything except for alligators. There is no answer for alligators. I don't know why they were created. Do not entertain alligators, that's it. <laughs> I'm afraid of not knowing something that I should know. I get very um, nervous when I walk into a situation and I don't know everything I feel I need to know. It really freaks me out. I'm afraid of not fulfilling my purpose. I'm afraid of um, anybody that's holding like a knife? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Who's not afraid of that? So what am I afraid of? I feel like that's a really deep, deep question here. Uh, I'm gonna go with, with the easy one and just say drowning. I am scared of drowning. I'm scared of my family drowning too. That's solid. Um, I would say I just discovered this summer that I am petrified of going into the ocean and encountering a shark. Because 
this summer we went into the ocean and nothing happened, but we watched Jaws and, <laughs> and the Meg and the Boost. <laughs> Do you remember when we were learning about the fruits of the spirit? Yeah, I love learning about them. Remember the song like Love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. What about we go back and watch it? Yeah! Yeah. Jumpstart 3. Galatians 5, 22 and 23. But the fruit of the spirit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. But the fruit of the spirit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. But the fruit of the spirit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. But the fruit of the spirit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Galatians 5, 22 and 23. This fruit right here. It's not from a tree, it's not from a loom, it's inside me Got filled with the spirit and it made me new Wanna see that fruit coming out of you God said when you trust you a new creation Time to accept that, that This fruit right here is not from a tree It's not from a loom, it's inside me This fruit right here is not from a tree that we had in 2020. Now we know that 2020 was a little bit local, a little bit wild, a little bit crazy. A lot of bad things happened, but also a lot of good things happened. And we are believing that 2021 is going to be amazing, right? Yeah. yeah. So I can't wait for 2021. We are starting a new year right now. And Saints Kids, we want you to continue to be a part of what God is doing. So don't forget to come back next week and every week. But before that, I want to pray. Can you guys repeat after me? Sure. Okay. Saints kids, please bow your heads, close your eyes, and repeat after me together with Chase and Dex. I got it right. Okay. Dear God. Dear God. God. Thank you so much. Thank, thank you so much. For this new year. For this new year. We're looking forward to it. We're looking, looking forward, forward to it. God, 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 we ask you, we ask you that on this new year, that on this, this new year, a lot of good things will happen. A lot, a lot of good things, things will happen. happen. But even if bad things happen, but, but even, even if, if bad, bad things happen, happen, that you're gonna help us, that, that you are gonna help us to be thankful, to be thankful, to be strong, to be strong, that you're gonna give us peace. That, that you are going to give us peace and wisdom and wisdom and strength and strength and all the fruit of the spirit and all the fruit of the spirit god god we love you we love you and we're thankful for you and we're thankful, thankful for you in the name of jesus we pray in the name of jesus we pray and everyone says amen amen thanks kids thank you for being with us today chase once again thank you Jax, once again thank you you guys are awesome See you next week. Bye. Bye.